I'm Matt Bichard with REIT.com here in New York City for REIT Week 2014. Joining me is Eric Frankel, analyst with Green Street Advisors. Eric, thanks so much for joining us. Thanks for having me. Now, what's been the big story in the industrial REIT sector so far in the first half of the year? It's been pretty smooth sailing, actually. So we could talk about it from two perspectives, one on the fundamental side and one on the capital side. On the fundamental side, things have been pretty good for the past few years. So the recovery in the industrial sector started relatively slowly when the economy started to turn about four years ago. And so you saw, saw a lot of absorption in the big box space, and that occurred across the country. And it occurred for uh, two reasons. One, because there's a lot more e-commerce related activity. And two, because larger corporations were a little bit better capitalized and they can focus on supply chain reconfiguration. However, recently, you've seen actually smaller businesses start to participate in the recovery, and you've seen a little bit better rent growth, and you've seen a little bit better oxygen growth among all the REITs in the market in general. On the capital side, industrial property values and cap rates are at all time highs and lows, respectively. So, so on the capital side, picking up on that, what, what are some of the trends you're going to watch for the rest of the year? Well, there's a lot of portfolios on the market now. It'll be really interesting to see who is going to pick it up. So there could be some REIT level interest, but there's also a lot of properties of mixed quality and it'll be interesting if institutional capital tries to pick it up from there. And, and lastly, if you had to pick a wild card that, that could turn the sector's favor, e either for the better or for the worse, what would that be? Well, supply is always an issue with the industrial sector, um, and it can come on really quickly because the construction cycle is relatively short. And so you always have to be cognizant of the fact that if demand is really good, that supply can follow in short order. And so that's what we'll probably be watching for over the next couple of years. Eric, thanks so much for joining us. Thanks a lot for having me. For more on this and other REIT news and analysis, be sure to visit REIT.com.